What's up guys? Tash here, Tash Tech. I need to just get a couple videos up quick. So I have, the other day, um, Bernard from, from AMS sent me a message saying, you need to come and, come and speak to me because I've got some printers you need to check out. And uh, believe it or not, he's given me three, not one, not two, but three, Flash forges, and they're currently here in my garage. <laughs> so, this is the big one. This is the uh, the, the uh, Guider Two. Jeez, it's a huge box. Uh, and then we have another two here. Um, I'm not even sure what they are. doesn't even say <laughs> okay I know that one of them is the that's all in Chinese all right guys anyway I'm gonna carry this inside okay and we're going to do an unboxing all right Okay, we have one inventor, one inventor two, and one guider two. And this one is the inventor. So, let's do this guys. Let's do this. So I'm so happy that actually that we actually got these printers in because I did like a lot of YouTubing and research before and there's not a lot of videos. I mean there's that there's that Chinese girl um, that does stuff on the Flash Forge, but Flash Forge himself also did a few videos. But other than that, I don't think they give out sponsorships. So I'm I'm really proud that um, I'm really glad that, that Bernard hooked us up. So we've got a little uh, information manual here. In fact that looks like a bed. Yeah, that's, that's the bed. There's a tray, maybe it's the top. Then we have a power cable. I'm foam holding it in here. And they're really nice machines. I really do like these uh, flash forges. Uh, let's get this boy out, okay. All right, so I'm gonna put this here because there's still a few more things in here. Look at this. Holy shit, there's like this, this little toolkit. How cool is this, guys? Can you, I don't mean, wow, there's like this cool little toolkit. I'm not, what is in this? And then there's a USB cable. Very good quality USB cable. At least they give you a good quality USB cable. Push that out the way. I had to unbox it on the floor in order to try and get everything. All right, so let's see what's in this. Oh, it's very nice. They've got a... It's nice, hey? Wow, that's that's a good tool to have. A little a knife with like a pointed plastic edge on one side. And the blade you can change out. Plastic tweezers, very nice to have because you don't want the... Uh, the metal ones because I find that the metal ones often they're a bit too strong and then what happens is you end up closing your hot end tip that's happened to me before you may call bullshit but I swear to you it's happened to me before I pinched it a little bit too tight and somehow it, it I think maybe the hot end was hot and then the brass obviously closed up I had to put a new tip on me a new hot end uh, a little plastic bag with some uh, little spanner a screwdriver some allen keys a little clip looks like it I like the fact that all these printer manufacturers nowadays are giving you um, paint scrapers to remove your your, uh, your your prints from the bed. This one has been grinded down on one side, which is good. You need to grind it down on one side. Like, that's... look at anyone. Okay, then we have a knob, an SD card, some PTFE tube in here. Very awesome. I love this little toolkit. 
it's very nice for your 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 starting off enthusiasts, right? I mean, it's got like everything there that you need. So let's put that there for one second. Let's try and get this. Get this open up. And now I've seem to lo lost my knife. Um, there it is. Okay, cut that on that side. Put that on that side. Let's see if we can pull this plastic off. Yeah, it looks like there's still some tape on the underneath here. Flash forges are just nice machines. Like they just give you everything that you need, right? Okay, there we go. There we go. Getting this boy out now. Yeah. Oh, look at that. Okay. So let's get this box off the top here. Yeah? Let's see if I can bring you guys in a little bit closer. Um, actually. All right. So if you open this box, we've got some plastic stuff in there. I'm not too sure. Extruder mounting screws. I'm not too sure what these are. Um, I don't know. And we've got the hot end here. Let me bring you guys in a bit closer. Okay, so this is the hot end here. I'm gonna pull this, that's this piece of foam out. Maybe I should probably read the instructions before I do this, but I mean, come on, we're guys here, right? All right, um, clearly I'm doing something wrong. Okay, what I'm gonna try to do is open the front here, rather. So we've got this tape that we're gonna peel off. going to remove this piece of foam behind the lead screw and then I'm just going to turn the lead screw to try and release this piece of cardboard underneath. Wow for the first time I'm actually seeing that it looks like there's a camera in here as well. Oh my goodness. So yeah it looks like they're doing something right. <laughs> well among other things, lots of other things. Uh, and just pull that up a little bit more so I can release the, this is the this is the Flashboard Inventor, but I think it's the dual nozzle one because there's some two rolls of filament. And I see two PTFE tubes as well. Okay, we've got one roll of filament up. Maybe the other roll of filament up. Take this foam out as well. It's a lot of stuff they've packed in here. Very really nice. I like it. Okay, so I'm assuming it's definitely dual dual extrusion. I thought I took the single extrusion one now to unbox, but we'll we'll do this one. Uh, I'm keen to see how this works. All right, hey. Okay, this is now I'm happy. All right, so I'm going to read the manual, but somehow this hot end has to get. Uh, mounted to the uh, the cage, uh, the carriage, and then I'm going to, and then I'm going to, and then I'm going to uh, put all this together, and we're going to run a test print, and I'm going to give you some nice gliding shots of it. All right, so stay tuned because right after this, I'm um, going to see how it works. Cool.